There's a graduation ceremony held not in a college hall, but in a hospital bed. Chris Tives is here with this emotional story and a very strong family to be able to talk about it, No Chris. doubt about that, Mike and Melissa. You know, she had all the brains and beauty in the world, not to mention the voice of an angel. What this Sam Houston State University student did not have was time. <laughs> Just 22 years old. She was brilliant. Mara De Souza could light up a stage. She brought sunshine into everybody's life. But that light. She was so beautiful. Soon turned to darkness. I would walk and, and think that it was not real. But he was. Last year, tumors were found in Mara's abdomen, a rare kind of cancer after surgery and chemotherapy. Her doctor told her we're, you know, we're kind of out of options. Her dream of traveling the world would never happen. This commencement is about the future, about a life well lived. Her dream of graduating college did happen just last week. Bachelor of Music degree. <laughs> From her hospital bed at the MD Anderson Cancer Center. Mara continually said, uh, this was one of the happiest days of her life. Dressed in cap and gown, Sam Houston State University brought the ceremony to her. Ladies and gentlemen, a college grad. <laughs> I was proud of her and her accomplishments, um, not just as a, a college grad, but just as a person that there would be so many people that would have this, um, this outpouring of love for our daughter. One week later, surrounded by family and friends at her home in spring. Mara Cassiana de Souza died with opera music playing in the background, moving her lips, singing one final time. She died singing, happy, and she's in a good place. She is in a good place indeed. The music department at Sam Houston State has named a scholarship for Mara for much more on that and her family blogs, including the complete graduation video, go to our website, myfoxhouston.com. Chris Stipes, Fox 26 News. Vandals caught on tape.